Hi, uh, this screencast is to show how to take backup of the existing email of new lecture and uh, delete that email. So first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to log in into the email which need to be backed up. So let's say I'm logging into Jaya at uh, newlector.com and I'm giving a password. So once uh, the email is opened, then you need to click on the top right corner. Uh, top right corner, this one, and you can uh, go to my account. And after clicking on my account, uh, just scroll down a bit, and you will have your personal info. Click on your personal info come down and you will have a option called download your data in terms of uh, creating archive this archive uh, usually google does and google sent a notification to you so let's click on create archive and here need to ensure you know what are the stuff you want to take the backup so let's say bookmarks calendars contacts drive uh, photos, groups, hangouts, mail. Uh, let's you know let it be uh, everything checked, and you can click on next. And so total uh, fifteen products is selected, and you can select the file type. So let's say file type dot zip, which is the standard format. Uh, so let it be dot zip, and delivery method so send download via email uh, or add to drive or add to dropbox or add to onedrive so let it be also send download link via the email and you can click on create archive moment you click on create archive it will you know give you and show you an option where you can see the ar archive is getting created and uh, it will take probably uh, one working day or sometime even it takes uh, you know uh, one hour max so it depends usually on the google server so google create the archive and google will send archive on the user email id so in our case uh, this is jaya at new lecture so once the google will create an archive you will get a notification uh, uh, here with the data so just you need to open that email and download that dot uh, zip folder uh, that particular dot zip folder will have the data of the entire email google docs seats everything uh, conversation every everything and you download that dot uh, zip file and then you can log in into the admin panel by going into admin dot dot com and admin can log in with their admin user id and then they can delete that particular user and that particular uh, you know deleted user can also be assigned to someone else uh, i mean you can create another user id with the same uh, subscription thank you so much